This is the man I love. I know one day we'll be married and have a great family. We have been seeing each other for a little longer than a year. I know one day this man will make me the happiest woman on earth. Sleep. Slept good. I had this wonderful dream that we lived in this big house. We had a few kids and a dog. Oh, yeah? I almost didn't want to wake up. <laughs> Dad, I had the same dream. We had like a pool. We lived in the mansion. <clears throat> had a whole bunch of servants catering to every will and everything. It was cool. Oh, yes, yes, yes. See, this is why I love you. You're always dreaming big. You have a nice job and you know how to treat a lady. Yeah, I guess I do. <laughs> so, Mr. Charmer, what do you have planned for us today? Hmm. Oh, man. What? I forgot. I had something planned, but I gotta go out of town later on. Oh. But, at least I came to stop by and got to see how that beautiful face was doing, you know? Well, I hope you came by to do more than just look. <laughs> you and I both know I can do a lot more than that. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, girl? What's going on? What's wrong with you? Did the kids break something? Take up my bed. No, for real, what's wrong with you? I can't. I can't help you with nothing. Tell me what's, what's, what's up. What's wrong with you? Baby. How long, Martin? How long what? Don't play games with me. How long? Now you have a family. <laughs> you know, you are something else. But you know, it's okay. Don't worry about the kids. That's my mother's place right now. So I'll ask you again. How long? About a year. About a year? Yo, calm down, calm down. Chill, okay, chill. That's, okay, calm that's down. some hard fuck on the weekends. It's not that I love you. You're the one I wanted to marry my whole life. Calm down. I love you. Okay? Look, you calm down. It's overreacting. I don't care about her. Okay? Look, it's, it's over with. Okay? From now on, it's done. Give me your phone. What? My damn phone. Martin, now's not the time to be asking questions. Give me your phone. What's her name? Hmm? Hmm? What's her name, Martin? Hmm? Hmm? What's her name? Martin, if you don't tell me this woman's name right, right, right now. Well, all right, look, look. Her name is Rebecca. Okay. Her name is not under Rebecca per se in, in the phone. Martin, if you don't tell me what this woman's name is. Her name is Rebecca. Okay. How can I find her? What's her name in the phone?
Her name in my phone is Mom. You one sick motherfucker. Sensitive, you feel me? Why do you care, Maria? She's just a hoe you fuck on the weekends, isn't she? Hi, Rebecca. How are you today? Hi, Dr. Rogers. How are you? Doing well. So I got your test results back, uh -huh. and they were what I expected. Congratulations, you're pregnant. Oh my God! <laughs> really? Really? Oh. <laughs> That's Martin now. Oh my god, I can't wait to tell him the news today. <laughs> well, before oh. you run out of here, I just need you to go ahead and go to the receptionist. Okay. And we'll start your prenatal care and book your next appointment, okay? Okay. Thank Congratulations you so again. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. But we do have a mutual friend. Oh, really? I'm sorry, I just never met you before. I'm not surprised. Why would Martin tell you about his wife of 10 years? A wife? No, he would have told me if he was married. <laughs> I'm sorry, honey, but I am his wife. <laughs> yeah, this has to be some type of joke. Where's Martin? I'm sorry, honey, but this is no joke. He's been lying to you. We have a family. We have children. We have a home. And I'm sorry, but that's just the reality of it. And if you don't believe me, here's video proof. You don't want help with the baby? No, my love, fine. I don't need your help. I'm surprised you kept the baby. Of course, I kept her baby. I don't believe in abortions. Mom and dad taught us that life is great and it's always precious. What are you gonna say when the baby asks about his dad? I don't know. I haven't seen Martin since I had that little encounter with his wife. I know. I didn't even know he was married, and on top of that, he has kids. Look, I'm your brother, and as long as I'm here, I'll be there for the baby. I'll be his dad and his uncle. Shit, I'll be his dacko. <laughs> Fine, Michael, you can be the dacko. I'm no expert, but I think that means the baby's coming. Yeah, no shit, go get the car. Yeah, I'll go get the car. Doctor, is everything okay? When we were trying to deliver the baby, his shoulders were stuck in the birth canal, reducing his oxygen flow. So, there is an issue. I mean? Your sister is fine, but the baby, I'm so sorry, but he passed away. Where's my sister? Yes, she's being discharged now. Um, I just came out here to tell you before so you can console her. But once again, I'm just so sorry for y'all's loss. I know it's going to be a difficult time. Thank you, doctor. I'll, I'll do my best. I'm sorry again. Rebecca, you can't honestly tell me you're going to sit in this room all day. Please get out. No, I've been giving you space for two months now. It's time to get up. 
Who are you to tell me what to do? Um, I'm your brother. That's who I am. Now get up. We're going to the park. We need to change the scenery. Michael, in the last year, my life has been turned on its fucking head. I mean, the man I thought who I was going to marry turns out to have a wife and kids. And on top of that, when I found out I'm carrying his baby, I run into his wife who politely tells me to fuck off. And then, after nine months of carrying a child, it dies during delivery. And now you're going to come in here and tell me to get a change of scenery? I don't want to hear it. I'll be fine just right here. You feel better now? Yeah, I do. Hey, great. Now get your butt up and take a shower because you stink a little bit. And put some clothes on. We're about to go to the park. I don't want to. Man, I don't care. You're leaving this house today. And I won't take no for an answer. Okay. That's the spirit. You don't know it's me. I just wanted to talk real quick. I know it's you. How've you been? I've been good. How are you? Look, let's, let's cut straight to business, okay? To be honest with you, it's been a minute, but I really miss you. A lot. Can you at least tell me what's been going on with you? What's new? Oh, what's new? You know yeah. what's new? Well, that baby that we had together, it died. Wait, what? Yeah, it died. And you didn't see me be there or care about it at all. your wife that you did not tell me about. But you 